In this 4 minute videos for developers, we are going to see how to create custom Apigee user roles and control the permissions on what API team members can do. Let's say you have decided to use Apigee Edge to do API management. Now there are various people who are working on building APIs and deploying the APIs and seeing the analytics and creating the custom reports and creating the API products. There are different assets that you can create as part of uh, API management in Apigee Edge. For example, you are creating API proxies, which are nothing but APIs, which will be exposed to the clients. You will be packaging these API proxies into API products, which will be exposed to developers. Again, there will be users or there will be automated uh, machines like developer portal, which will be creating these developers whenever developer gets registered and you would like to control who can actually create applications and you would like to control who can actually see the reports as well as create some custom reports. So when you have API team members who are developing APIs, maintaining APIs and managing these APIs, you would like to assign some of the assets operations to some of the team members. For example, creating API proxies and deploying API proxies to someone and then creating API pro to proxies to some other to control the access who can do what in Apigee Edge. So you would like to create a different roles who can do what in Apigee Edge. For example, particular user, let's say analytics business user can only see analytic reports. Or for example, a super admin, which is an org administrator in Apigee Edge who have, will have control access to everything. Not only these assets that are shown in the slide, you can individually control who can do what in Apigee Edge for every entity and asset that you create or you manage in Apigee Edge. Not only using UI, you can able to do it using management APIs, uh, using which you can able to control the permissions at very granular level. Let's see how the custom roles works and what are the default roles in Apigee Edge. As you can see, I'm logged in into Apigee Edge as an ARC administrator. ARC administrator is nothing but super administrator who will have access to everything. Let's see what are the custom roles. To see the roles, click on admin and uh, click on roles. These are the default roles that comes out of the box with Apigee Edge. You can also create custom roles. These roles will have different permissions and the users belongs to one of the roles. Arc administrator, like I said, is a super administrator. Once you click on this particular role, you can see what all the operations you can able to do. As you can see, Arc administrator have access to everything after the slash. In Apache, every feature that you see is actually an API. And you can able to control access to that particular feature by adding this particular API to the user role. So since it is a slash, you get access to everything, including get, put, delete. Let's see some other roles. For example, if we navigate to the built-in role like uh, developer administrator, which is given to developer portal because developer portal makes an API call and creates a developer application. As you can see, developer portal has uh, only get access to everything and uh, some of the access like put and delete on small docs API models. And for example, uh, create update and delete on developer applications. These are the permissions that developer portal uh, has to interact with Apache Edge. Similarly, you can create custom roles and assign team members, API team members to those custom roles and uh, control who can do what in Apache Edge. For example, if you want to create a custom role, you can click on custom role. Let's say I want to give only analytic report access. Then I can create a role called analytics uh, user and I can give only access to create analytic reports and view analytic reports and edit analytic reports and delete analytic reports. So you can use the UI to define some of the features or entities permissions in Apigee Edge. Like for example, who can create an API, who can update an API, who can delete an API. But using management APIs, you can able to control individually to each and every feature who can do uh, get or update or create or delete using the APIs. You can able to see the list of users by clicking on uh, users uh, uh, link and you can able to update the role by clicking on the user and then clicking on edit and then you can give the role. For example, for Anil, I want to give one more role, let's say uh, uh, operations administrator. Then you can able to give that role and click on save. That's how you can able to create custom roles uh, and assign users to the roles or even update the existing users with the new roles and control who can do what in Apache Edge. If you have any questions, please feel free to post your questions in community.apache.com. Subscribe to YouTube channel and share this video with your friends and colleagues.